Okay, teachers, I'm going to be showing you um, how to get to your Canvas account if you decide to use Microsoft Edge um, while we're dealing with this issue with Google Chrome. Um, so what I did at the bottom of my desktop where it says type here to search, I just typed in Edge and then Microsoft Edge um, popped up and then I tapped on open, which is the window that you see right here. I wanted to walk you through this because I wanted to make sure that you did not, um, that you followed the right process. Let's just put it that way. When I opened up Edge, because I haven't been in Edge at all, it shows like an old picture of me um, back from when our email um, did not, that it wasn't short. It was like the .k12.in.us and it says not syncing. When I first clicked on that, it was telling me to try to sync. Well, it's not syncing to Google, it's trying to sync to like a Microsoft account, so do not do that method. Um, okay, so I just clicked off of it, and then the next thing I want you to do is just type in google.com. When you type in google.com, then it's going to come up with the sign-in. Obviously, it's gonna tell you hey, it's easier if you switch to Chrome, but because we're dealing with a Chrome um, update issue right now, do not do that. Don't switch to Chrome. Otherwise, you're gonna be right back where you started. Um, so I'm just gonna go in here to sign in, and I'm gonna log into my account. Um, whoops. And don't worry, I'll blur out my password stuff. Um, so that we don't need to worry about that. I'm not saving my password. Um, so now, even though I see at the top it's got like the Microsoft stuff, here is my Google account, and now I can go back to my usual method um, where I'm gonna see that waffle and I can get to my Canvas. Okay, I just wanted to do this video so that that way everybody knows the correct way um, for you guys to actually get to this um, if you're going to have to use Microsoft Edge. Um, now, if you notice, um, students are not having the issue, but yet teachers are. Um, so when I talk to Tyler in our IT department about that, it is because your desktops have automatically updated to the most recent version of Chrome. Students, because of state testing, it only lets them update their Chrome version up to a certain point. So that's why we're not hearing that students are having an issue, um, that it's just you guys as teachers. Okay, um, so hopefully this will clear this up. I will definitely let you know once um, the Chrome update has been fixed and you don't have to use Microsoft Edge anymore. It shouldn't be too much longer. All right, thanks.